So what do you get when you have five women on sugar? <laughs> So I uh, just wanted to update everybody. Today is Sunday. Happy St. Patrick's Day. It's March 17th. I'm wearing my green. Um, so last night's patrol, very quiet. No turtle sightings anywhere to be seen. But then again, uh, there was a poacher out, but he got, I assume he got nothing as well. So that's a good thing. Uh, we are here at the last camp. So Latin American sea turtles putting on the market today. Local vendors put on stuff. We have the uh, junior high school students from Oakville, Ontario. Uh, they came down to Costa Rica to learn about the culture, do some volunteer work, work a little bit on the hatchery. They uh, did some uh, concrete work over at the local school here. So really good for them to be part of this. See what Costa Rica is all about. Um, I'm sure it's quite different than in Canada, and especially where it's uh, winter time, Ontario. So. Um, but yeah, today was just uh, very windy in the morning. Uh, it's still kind of windy. Um, not sure why, but the tides were really, really rough. Uh, I wanted to go swimming, but I was like, ah, the currents are just really strong. And, oh well, but we sort of uh, stay around the camp day, do laundry, get some cleaning done. There'll be some more surprises later on, so stick around. Hey guys, so this is uh, when a prank goes wrong. Um, yeah, I was trying to climb a tree to hide from my friends and try to scare them, but uh, I slipped and I scratched myself. You can see, here's the cut. Yeah, look at that. It was a lot bloodier before, but... Uh, Jed from uh, France, she's uh, helping me out here, cleaning me up, taking care of me. She's wonderful, doing a great job cleaning it. We're gonna bandage it and you know, try to recover and stay away from trees for a little bit. So, thank you. <laughs> Sasha! Sasha! Sasha. Jack. Oh no! Oh. No! <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> nice! Hey! Oh my god. You did a nice look. Go, Catherine! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> I've got her Batman. Hey, so I just got back from uh, playing soccer with some school kids. They're from Oakville, Ontario, Canada. Played in goal. It was a lot of fun just hanging out with them. They're a really good team. Even though their goaltender was uh, Leo, a local local boy from here. Uh, he's like eight or something like that. And yeah, that, that was their goalie. And, for some reason we still lost, but uh, probably because I let in most of the goals, but as you can see, I did make a few saves, so yeah, it was a lot of fun. so good. so happy. Oh, I <laughs> 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 like what Jose made, look at that awesome. Yeah, it's been devoured. Yeah. <laughs> So what do you get when you have five women on sugar? <laughs> Happy birthday, Jose! Banana nut birthday. Yeah! Banana nut 
you. So here we are, we're gonna enjoy some supper. It's supper time, we are welcoming our new guests, David and Andre from Halifax, Nova Scotia, Canada. And we also have Rosie from Edmonton, Alberta, home of the Edmonton Eskimos, only second best to Saskatchewan, of course. And the Oilers. Yeah, the yeah. Oilers. <laughs> David, you have a special message from a certain special someone. Is that correct? I do. <laughs> Ed, uh, Ananya. Ananya. Yes. Oh, yes. What was yeah. her message? What did she say? She just said hello to everyone. She had a wonderful time. Yep. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Yeah. So, oh, shout yeah. out to you, Ananya. Oh, Thank yeah. you. We yeah, we all say hi, right? Hi, hi Ananya. <laughs> yeah. See, we miss you, Ananya. So, yeah. Oh, thanks for uh, communicating that to us. And welcome to our new yeah. guest. And okay. we're gonna enjoy our supper. Okay. Look what Jess made yeah. for us. Yummy. <laughs> Today is day 16. We had a long day at the hatchery. We dug in the morning and then later on in the afternoon we also did more digging. Filling in the hatchery uh, just needs to be done so came back, did my workout, feel a lot better now, loosened up and now it's time for uh, craft and arts time and we're going to do a DIY uh, over the shoulder bag or no so bag is what they call it. So. Uh, I already done one earlier and it seemed to work out. Something like this. See that? And I put my rain poncho in it. You can put any jacket, whatever, light item. Put your water bottle in it for those night patrols. Um, yeah, so it comes in handy. And one of the fundamental principles we follow here at La Tortuga Feliz is to reuse, recycle, and reduce. So, in this case, we are reusing an item. If you no longer need that t-shirt, hey, why not turn it into a bag, right? So I have this t-shirt here. For those who know, this is the late Rob Ford, former mayor of Toronto. And this is when he was caught smoking marijuana. And it was just sort of a gag t-shirt. So, you know, I worked hard on it and, oh God, it smells, but hey, it's gonna change into a Okay, so all you really need is a t-shirt that you don't want, uh, whether it has sleeves or not, it doesn't matter. In this case, I already cut off the sleeves, a pair of scissors, cut, and let's begin. So it kind of looks like a tank top, something like this, see that? Tank top, there's your original shoulder strap, it just goes way down low, and eventually you will have to cut the sleeves off, so do that as well. Cut the sleeves, you can see it's sleeveless, and basically a really low tank. So at the bottom of the t-shirt, there is the, uh, the fold in here. Just cut a slit just so it opens it up. Okay, so now I have an opening in here. Like this. And remember that uh, that collar strap there? We'll reuse that. We'll cut off the tag. That. And we'll tie a knot so that we can push it through. Gee, uh, 
basically through the bottom of the t-shirt where we cut the slit. Where is that? Ah, oh, there it is. See? I found it right here. Okay. And we'll just push it through to the end. Okay. And this is probably the hardest part out of anything. All right, so once you fold the string through the hole at the bottom of the shirt and you cinch everything together, you have the uh, string in a small hole like this at the very bottom. This will be the bottom of the bag. I didn't run into a little snag trying to thread the, uh, the line through the bottom, so I took a nail and just sort of threaded it through and pushed it through. made a pretty little bowl on the end. So I will show this to you in the day. Uh, also just an update on last night's patrol. Um, I was the um, 11 to three shift. Yeah. Uh, we, we did see a turtle. Uh, the 10 o'clock patrol actually came across a turtle that was uh, on the beach and that was Jana and Luisiano, her boyfriend. Hi Jana. And so, um, yeah, so they were lucky to see a turtle last night. That was my seventh turtle, and that was Jenna's fifth. So, very exciting. I'm on number seven. Hopefully, tonight we see number eight. And it is raining, so it's going to be a pretty wet patrol. Otherwise, uh, we'll update you tomorrow. Peace.